James here. Today I have a little unboxing and how to uh, connect the MPOW Freebang Bluetooth speaker. Now this is a fully functional Bluetooth speaker. It is bigger than the normal Bluetooth speakers I've seen them put out before, but you know, that doesn't mean anything. This is, like I said, fully Bluetooth functional. It shows you it's, a, uh, it's supposed to be semi-waterproof. My guess is it's water resistant. You know, you got your power connectivity, 4400 mAh battery, and your uh, speaker volume levels. Well, let's pull it open so you guys can see it. I'll set this aside, pull everything out, and then give you a rundown of it. As you can see, you got your micro USB to USB so you can charge it. You have an auxiliary out, 3.5 jack, headphone jack or jack to whatever component you want to use. Of course, you get the user manual, which if you flop it open, it'll tell you how to power it on, pair it up with your devices. Then you have the device itself. Let's give you a close-up. You see if you can see in there, it's actually a blue-colored paint on the actual thing itself with a rubber covering. I'm sure you could probably pull the rubber covering off, but... You can see it's got a ghost logo on the side. On the back it gives you, you know, what it is. Made in China. It's got your auxiliary, charging, and then power bank. So, if you use it for the power bank, it means you can actually charge your phones from this. You can either charge your phone, you can charge a few other things, probably your tablets. If you use the middle piece, that's for charging this device itself, and then the jack is for connecting up to devices using it with the jack. On the top, um, you have the power button. You guys can't really see it that well, but, you know, it's there. You have your forward and back, your volume up and down, and then your Bluetooth pair device. Now, what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to grab my smartphone, and I'm going to connect it up so you guys can see it connecting. Let me change. Let me grab that for a second. I'll be right back. Okay, now that I have my actual phone with me, you hit your power on the device right over here. As you can hear, it came on. That means it's on. I will do this, turn my phone on. You go up to your Bluetooth settings right here. You'll have to turn your Bluetooth on which is sliding over. Now that it's on, it shows the MPOW Bluetooth headset and it's still searching. Bluetooth pairing request. Click request. And now we're connected. We'll slide over. We'll go in here. We'll just grab a, a song. I don't know how loud it is right now, so. That's technically not the song that's playing, but that's a phone issue. Now it is on and playing. You can turn it up. Without you, my friend, and I'll tell you all about You can turn it down by your phone. I'll set my phone down. You can also do it over here. <laughs> when you do it that way, as you can tell, you get the beep, which is rather annoying. So you can do it by either if you really wanted. You could also change the song. So frustrated was closing but as you can see, it works rather well. It is rather does have a nice volume to it. I, I mean, you could probably take this anywhere outside, like you know, the beach, picnic, anywhere you want to take this. It should have a good battery life. I would suggest probably a few hours play of straight playtime, which is perfect. Um, I'm pretty sure you could probably charge your cell phone off this probably at least four times. Uh, maybe not. 
I haven't gotten to that much far testing, but this thanks for checking out the Impal unboxing and how to connect it up to your device and how it works. Thank you.